Hi, welcome back. In this video, we're going to take a look at Microsoft Outlook, and we're going to look at setting up an appointment and how to change certain settings so that Microsoft Teams doesn't automatically pop up when you go to invite people to this meeting. So first, let me show you what's happening with this new update we found is that if you go over here to a new appointment or if you double click on a date, let's say, and then you want to invite attendees right here, you click invite attendees, what's happening is automatically you're getting this Microsoft Teams meeting message down at the bottom, and you may or may not want that at the bottom of your invitation. For the most part, in our school district, we have not been using Microsoft Teams, so this is something that can be problematic because if this is an invite to parents, they might be confused as to whether or not this is a virtual meeting or you're actually going to meet in person. You can simply turn that off right here by clicking Don't Host Online, and that will remove that message from the bottom. If you want to make sure that's off completely and Teams meetings doesn't automatically default to popping up at the bottom, here's how you would change that. What you want to do is you want to go over to File at the top, and then you want to go down to Options, and you want to make sure it's clicked on Calendar. And then what you want to do is look at the Calendar options right here where it says Add Online Meeting to All Meetings. And it says add meeting provider. If I click that, notice how it says add online meeting to all meetings. What we want to do is uncheck that box and hit OK. Now I'm going to hit OK down at the bottom. And again, I'm going to double click on a date or I could go up here to new appointment. Now when I click invite attendees, notice how that message does not show up anymore. So it's not automatically putting the Teams option there. If for some reason you wanted to use Teams as an option, you could always turn that on by just clicking this Teams meeting option right here. And then you'll get the same option that pops up. And if you want to take that back, you could click this Don't Host Online. So I hope that video helped. If you have any other questions, you can always email me at kbolendorf at fleetwoodasd.org. Until next time, have a great day.
So first you would close this, 